Hey guys, it's Heather with TwoBlooms.com and in this Lightroom tutorial I'm going to show you how to edit be beach pictures in Lightroom. So let's get started right away. Um, let me preface this by saying I'm not a beach photographer but these are from my own family uh, vacation pictures and I wasn't really prepared for them. I shot them very underexposed as you can see. I tried to expose for the sky and the water but my subjects were a little bit dark. So I'm going to show you how to brighten it up without losing the sky and the water and to really polish it. So let me just show you this picture um, as a starting point. I'm not going to be editing this picture but um, just to show you what you can do in Lightroom. Here's the before and the after and the before is pretty um, pretty bad straight out of camera. I didn't have a flash, I had tired kids and I had to do these really quick. So I shot in RAW and I was able to really um, pull this together in Lightroom by using some tools. Okay, so I'm going to be applying the same principles as I used in this photo for this one. So let's get started. So first of all, I'm just going to come over to my basic panel and I'm going to up the exposure just a tiny bit. I don't want to blow out the sky anymore. So just a little bit works for me. Now the white balance is way off. It's very, very cool. So I'm going to come over to my temperature slider and I'm just going to adjust it accordingly. So that looks about right. I can always adjust this later. I don't want it to be too warm. So that's pretty good starting off before and after, not too bad. Okay, so the next thing I want to do is, if you know anything about me, um, I use presets all the time. So I'm going to be using a preset from my new Life in Color collection. It's one of my favorites currently. And I really want this image to pop and to add some brightness in the middle. And I'm, so I'm going to use Radical. Radical is probably my all-time favorite preset. I use it on a lot of my photos. So what this did is it really just brightened it. It brightened, it adds a center light and it adds a tiny, tiny bit of matte to the photo. Um, I am going to up the temperature just a tiny bit because sometimes with this preset it makes your images look cooler but that looks pretty good. Okay, so I could leave this here um, and I could just darken up the sky a bit so it doesn't look so blah, but I really want to add some color and a, a beachy feel. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over to my brush tool and I'm working in Lightroom 6, so if you're working in a earlier version of Lightroom, your toolbar might look different up here, but the adjustment brush is a great tool to use. Okay, so what I did here is I have already created some brushes. You see my ocean water brush and my peach sunset brush. I created them when I edited this picture um, down here in the left corner. So I'm going to work on the sky first. So I'm going to pick my peach sunset brush and you can see how my settings changed. Um, Basically this brush, I lowered the exposure, up the contrast, and then added some color. So you can create your own brush um, by adjusting these settings. I actually might bring this color down just a little bit. Um, and then I'm just going to apply it towards the sky. And it might be a little, it's a little uh, too much, but I'm going to adjust it. So I'm just going to quickly go over this sky, make sure that I got all of it. And that's about good. And I can come over here and I can adjust the amount. There, that looks pretty good. Now I have some, um, this dark line over here, I could come over here and grab my eraser brush. Let me put my overlay on there and see how I got some of the brush onto the water can just come over here and erase that off really quickly. Now this isn't going to be perfect because I'm just trying to show you um, how to do this. And there we go. 
So, there we go. Okay, so let me go over that sky again. There we go. All right, so that's the basic principle. I am going to decrease the amount just a little bit so it's not too crazy. Um, you can adjust this to your liking. If you like more pastels, if you like um, more vibrant colors, I mean, that's pretty intense, but whatever suits your style and floats your boat. So I'm going to leave it probably right about there. And then I'm going to come over here and I'm going to um, add a little bit more blue to this water because we went into a, a beach that was beautiful. The ocean was super blue and gorgeous. So I really want to enhance that in the picture. So I'm going to just go over here and click new. And I'm going to go to my ocean water pre preset. It's a brush preset. And I'll just um, open this menu so you can see what I did. I just added a little bit of contrast and I chose this really pretty blue color. Now I'm just going to go over the entire ocean area. Now this might seem a little vivid to begin with, but I can always adjust it. Not a problem. And I'm just going to quickly go over this. I'm not going to care if I get it on their hair or anything, but um, I'm going to actually undo a little bit of the contrast and then I can change the amount here or I can come over here and just choose a different color blue. And there we go. Just the lighter color that you choose, it's a little less dramatic. Okay, so that's it. I'm done with my brushes. I could come in here and touch them up more and make them look beautiful, but I'm not going to be meticulous in this video. Um, I don't want to bore you. So that's looking pretty good. And I think um, just to polish up this picture I'm just gonna add a little bit more blacks because I like contrast and maybe some more whites just to make it pop a little bit more and I am gonna do one more thing I'm gonna come back to my brush sorry I'm not done with my brushes yet and I'm just gonna use a light dodge brush over their faces just to make them stand out a little bit more since I wasn't using a reflector or using flash. I just want to add that little bit more pop of light in their face. Okay, so that's pretty much it. To polish it up, I can come down here and adjust my sharpening. My, there we go. Mask it off a little bit. And that looks pretty good. So you can see the before and after just by applying um, a preset and some brush strokes. And you can get really creative with the brushes and the colors. I could go in here and I could add different colors. You see how it's kind of orange down here and blue. Um, you can certainly do that. You could also play around with your graduated filters. But the sky's the limit in Lightroom and that's what I love about it. There's so many things that you can do to really bring your photos to life. So I hope you found this tutorial useful and that you can use it in your own beach pictures and not just beach pictures but everyday pictures. So thanks for tuning in and if you want to see more tutorials make sure you check out my YouTube channel and subscribe. So thanks so much guys and I hope to see you soon. Bye.